is such a it's such a beautiful thing to see the evolution of creatine but even it's funny because now we're seeing like both where we have creatine and bhb each of which was discovered in a particular realm or, or appreciated in a particular realm to say that a better way bhb has long been appreciated in the neurological central nervous system brain realm creatine has long been appreciated in the muscle exercise performance realm and now we've been able to see them each sort of step past the other where there's the explosion in research showing looking at ketones and muscle function which is which was very that's much newer you know you you started the conversation by mentioning the evidence with epilepsy we've had studies in humans for over a hundred years yes for a century documenting the effects of ketogenic diets on things like epilepsy and migraines so very obvious overt brain things and then we've had evidence for decades looking at the benefits of creatine in muscle and now they're sort of crossing each other while giving each other a high five or like the scene <laughs> it's like that ending scene from from like with arnold and his bicep you know gripping the other guy's arm uh, yeah. from from a predator um, where it's like the glute, the ketone and the creatine are e giving each other a big firm hand clasp on their way past each other, where now the latest research is showing the remarkable benefits of creatine in, in the brain and yes. with cognition and neuroinflammation from sleep deprivation and all of this new research looking at the use of ketones in muscle and performance. So there is, I, I don't mean to kind of hijack the question, but in my view, there is a beautiful synergy to to use Rob's term with with the one plus one equals three. That mm. to me, an optimal use is to enhance the reliance on the phospholytic system by really taking advantage of creatine in any of its forms, and then to preserve the glycolytic capacity and even enhance the overall mitochondrial uh, milieu. By by promoting mitochondrial biogenesis with the presence of the ketones, you'll get big. <laughs> Imagine if you could feel it, and that's where this this is going to be bigger than creatine because you can feel it. 